Hi, this is Narayan from Sunya Technologies. We are located in Kerpuram, Bangalore. Today, I am going to explain the program to find the number of occurrences of a character in a string like below. For example, if we provide input as good morning, then we need to count number of characters. Here, G occurrences two times. Now, G is equal to two. And O occurrences three times. O is equal to three. And D occurrences 1, D is equal to 1, and white space 1, white space is equal to 1, and so on. We will discuss this program or Visual Studio. Launch the Visual Studio and create console application. Console dot write off. Please provide input string. We need to read the value from command prompt. Use console.readLine string input string equal to console.readLine. First, we need to check string is empty or not. We'll use while loop while input string dot length greater than zero. Then count the number of occurrence of a character. We will declare one variable to count the number of occurrence of a character. Int count of cat equal to 0. String is a collection of characters. That means string is an array of characters. If you want to get the character from array, we will use index number, we will we'll get first character of string using index number, console dot write of input string and pass the index number as 0. So here taking index as 0 and written character that means we will get first character of the string. We'll use for loop to get the characters from the string and compare first character with uh, all the characters from the string. We declare for loop to get the characters of string for int i equal to 0 i less than input string dot length i plus plus We will use if condition to check first character of string with all the characters of the string. If input string of 0 equal to input string of i If input string of 0 is equal to input, input of string of i then we will increment the count count of character plus plus and print the count console dot write line count of characters once we calculate the occurrence of first character then we need to remove first character of a string using replace method use replace method here using input string dot replace of Replace method contains two overload methods. One method taking two characters, another method taking two string values and returning string. So we will use two string values as a parameters. Input string of 0. This input string array taking index number and returning character. So we need to convert character to string using two string method and replacing input string of 0 value with empty string dot empty replace method taking two string values as input and returning string so store it in string variable input string we will execute this program without debugging control f5 please provide input string I am providing input string as good 
enter and G occurrences one time and O occurrences two times and D occurrences one time. We will discuss this program with de over debugging to understand the flow of the execution. Go to debug and click step into that means F11. Please provide input string. Good. Enter. Here input string dot length that is 4, 4 greater than 0 is true. Goes to insert while loop. Count of characters is called 0. Input string of 0 that means input string of 0 is G. Representing first character G. Then we are using for loop. For int i is called 0. I less than input string dot length. I less than 4 that means 0 less than 4 true. Then here we are comparing input string of 0 equal to input string of i. Here will be in input string of 0 means g and input string of i is equal to g. Okay, both are equal. Then increment count. Now count is equal to 1. Then i is equal to 1. 1 less than 4. True. Then input string of 0 equal to input string of 1. False. Then i is equal to 2. 2 less than 4. Input string of 0 equal to input string of 1. Input string of 1 is O. Both are not equal. Then i is equal to 3. So not equal. That is false. Then i is equal to 4, 4 less than 4 false, exit from for loop and count of characters is equal to 1. Then later we need to remove the g. So here we use replace method. So replace method taking input string of 0 that means g and replacing g with empty. Now here input string is equal to ood. Then this ood passing to input string so here length 3 3 greater than 0 count of character 0 then we are printing o equal to int i is equal to 0 then length length 3 0 less than 3 true then input string of 0 that means o o equal to o increment now count is equal to 1 then i is equal to 1 so 1 less than 3 then input string of 0 input string of 0 is o and input string of i is equal to i means so right click quick watch input string of i is equal to o so both are equal increment i is equal to 2 then input string of 0 equal to input string of 2. Both are not equal. i is equal to 3. 3 less than 3 false. Then count is equal to 2. Then re so remove O. So here we are using replace method. Input string is equal to D. Then length greater than 0. So we are printing D equal to and then length 1. So 0 less than 1. True. Input string of 0 equal to input string of 0. Count is equal to 1. Then i is equal to 1. 1 less than 1. False. Exit from for loop. Count is equal to 1. And replacing d. Input string is equal to null. Input string dot length greater than 0. False. Exit from program. And output as g is equal to 1. O is equal to D is equal to 1. Control F5. Good morning. Enter. And we will get output as G is equal to O is equal to 3, D is equal to 1 and so on. That's it for today. If you like this video, please share with your friends and subscribe to my YouTube channel for future videos. Thank you for watching. Have a nice day. Hi.